On Wednesday, the Penobscot Pioneers girls hockey co-op will battle for the Class A North title and a trip to the state finals game. Pioneers head down to Portland to take on the Yarmouth Freeport Co-op, the number one team in A North. Penobscot and Yarmouth skated to a tie their last time out. And besides that, the girls have won 12 of their last 13 games. And they say what's helped is really how the team has grown off the ice since first coming together this fall. Man, I think uh, we just kind of learned how to work as like a team and kind of clicked. Um, we've started supporting each other, having better attitudes on the bench. And I think that has a lot to do with it. Um, I think the energy is really good. All the girls are really excited. Uh, coaches are looking excited. They're really happy for us. They put a lot of work in. Well, at the start, we kind of knew each other, but not really. But now we're like super close, I guess you want to call it. And I don't know. It's just like a little family. It, I wouldn't want to do it with a different group of girls. In their first year as a program, Penobscot is in position to make history. As the northernmost girls hockey team in Maine, Penobscot beat the other northernmost team, the Winslow Gardner Black Tigers, in the semifinals. And the Black Tigers are really, if you ask the girls in Penobscot, the team that got the ball rolling for girls hockey up here. Um, if we won this, it would be because of them. They're, they're the ones that let me, they're the ones that brought me in and then now we have this this year. It would be because of them. That would mean everything. That would be a full circle for sure because I'm sure some people thought pretty low of us coming in here and it just proved to everyone that we can be the best and that we can win it all.